Hello. I'm here. My camera's gonna go in the middle. Yay. Uh, I'm going to record myself singing um, a song called The Song of Purple Summer from Spring Awakening. I'm doing this because a friend of mine posted a video of her singing and she was nervous about it. So I'm going to do it as an act of good faith and make her feel better about herself. Because that's how I view my voice. I view my, my singing talent as a way of saying, you know what, you think you can do bad? Look at this overconfident person start to sing. Um, I technically am trained, technically not, because I haven't had a voice lesson in four years or so. Um, as you can tell from my horrible posture, because I am slouched over at the moment, looking into the camera. Set up straight, be like this. This camera needs to like... Mm. Maybe I should hold this. Open up my... No, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing that. So yeah, this is what I get from recording from my bed. Oh, I'm also doing this one take, because... Blah. To prove a point, um, to make her feel better. So, this is for Sarah. And I'm singing, because she sung, she's a soprano, and I'm not a soprano. I used to be a soprano, and then my voice was like, what? High notes? Um, so I'm an alto. And with that in mind, I'm not going to sing soprano in, well, I guess I, if I want to make her feel better, I should sing soprano. But instead, I'm singing an alto song. I am singing the solo part from the Song of Purple Summer from Spring Awakening, because that is alto, which is one of the reasons I really love this musical. It brought alto to the forefront. All right, so here it begins. And I shall fade the flowers of spring, the world in all the sorrow at the heart of everything. But still it stays, the butterfly sings, and opens purple summer with the flutter. I'm not gonna sing the whole song. Um, I'll spare you that. So yeah, 